Next game up. The game I'm most interested in because this is the biggest test for Cincinnati until Notre Dame. Cincinnati is going to Indiana. I think this Indiana team's pretty good. I think Indiana got their ass beat by Iowa, and we're realizing Iowa, pretty good football team, okay? I don't take anything away from that. Now, Indiana this weekend beat the crap out of Idaho. What I would write down 56 to 14. Um, they finally, it's amazing. Michael Penix Jr. looks like a completely different quarterback when he's not having to go against Iowa's defense. Isn't that spectacular? Like, th- this is this is what you got. Cincinnati's defense, pretty damn good, but I don't think they're as good as Iowa. So, Indiana's basically going to fall somewhere in the middle of beating up on Idaho and getting drummed by Iowa um, in the Cincinnati game. If they can score, they can keep this thing tight. If they struggle to score... I think they're going to struggle here because I like and trust Desmond Ritter more than anybody else on the field. If it comes down to – let's break this game down real quick before – because I'm sure this is going to be in the big game previews. I think both of these teams are really, really, really well coached. And I think they're going to play this game from the defensive side of the ball. Okay, I think they want they both want this to be low scoring. I think they both want this game to to not get out of hand and they just want to try to not make mistakes. The other team defensively, I think they're going to both be really aggressive on defense. Um, Which quarterback do you trust? Do you trust Penix or do you trust Ritter? And man, blind going into this thing. I trust Ritter. Once again, you got a road team favored going on the road. At home, or, you know, in a hostile environment. Now, this is a G5 school going to a P5 school. Indiana, pretty good. Not great, but pretty good. Cincinnati minus three and a half. It's actually a little smaller than I was expecting. I thought this line would be around five as well. So, so, so they're not giving Cincinnati the due that I think some of these other schools are getting. The other side of that coin is I think I think there's a little bit more public respect on Indiana. I think we're seeing now after getting two data points on Iowa, oh Iowa beating the hell out of Indiana doesn't mean that our thoughts about Indiana being pretty good goes away. Indiana could be a hell of a football team. They just got beat by Iowa. Um I'm excited to 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 get more into the weeds of that game. And uh, and give you a lean one way or another. Like I said, right now, if you made me pick this game today, and I'm going to go Cincinnati. I'm going to go with Desmond Ritter. I'm going to go with the quarterback because I like both these coaches. I think this. I think these teams want to play the same style, though. That's what I find most interesting about that game. 